Yo, what is up guys, Johnny Geiger here. Today it is time to relearn some legendary tricks of day one song. One of the greatest things that has ever been uploaded on YouTube is the brand new Damon Song documentary. This is Day One Song. True legend in the skate scene has over a million Instagram followers, a huge influence to my skating. One of my favorite skaters. When I just started, Skate More came out almost round three. Amazing video parts. That's why I decided to make a video about some of the tricks that he did. That far, we have to go back to something that I filmed like one month ago. Damon Song is known for landing some of the world's sickest skateboarding combos. Today we're gonna try to duplicate some from his almost round three part. Epic piece of skating. But first of all we gotta take care of the mini pad and hopefully it's not gonna rain. So the mini pad is supposed to dry up soon while we're waiting on this. We're gonna do what we always do. We're gonna pick up some trash. We're gonna do a favor to Mother Nature to appreciate what we got from it. All right, done with this now. I've seen worse. Usually I fill like a bottle with cigarettes, which is pretty nasty because like one cigarette messes up like 60 liters of clean water. And right now we find ourselves in an age where we should be taking care of nature. All right, let's try to start this off. First trick, super decent mani combo. Nolly tray flip into mani, tray flip out. First step of trying this trick, doing a mani, tray flip out and a not tray flip many. It took me three tries, four tries. So much fun. All right, not tray flip many. This took me more tries than I expected. Now let's try to combine them. An army of scooter kids just came to the park, like 10 kids in one mob. I like the wrong foot positioning to actually tray flip out, so I decided to go for kick flip. Give me a few tries trying to redo it like better. No tic tac. 
the height of the mani pad makes it really hard for the trayful bout, makes it easier on the trayful bin though. Yeah, I did that. Nolly trade flip, Manny trade flip out. On the same day, I tried to do another combo from almost round three. The fakey nose, Manny, fakey flip nose, Manny, fakey flip out. But I, I just couldn't do it. At some point, it started to rain and I had to dump the challenge. Trading Manny's is not something to underrate. Like, you have to lock in every time perfectly, your body weight has to be perfectly balanced. If you just mess it up like the slightest bit, you're not gonna land the trick. And it can cost you some nerves, you know. I've been trying the simple version of the trick for like 30 minutes, and it was such a battle to get that. Just psyched on the one that I got, like the simple version. I know it didn't flip out, but I'm, I'm just gonna save that for another challenge. I forget to mention here one thing that is super amazing on day one's clip. He does it on a mani pad that is way shorter than that, but that makes it super hard. Like, uh, I, I feel like I need time to balance out the mani after landing, fake a flip into mini again, and some time to place my feet for flip out. So that's absolutely crazy. I also tried to skate some transition, a tray flip fakey. Since my tray flips on flat are super unlocked, at least I feel like that, I decided to try it out on the quad pipe. And it's gonna take me some tries to get close to day ones. But the ones that I got felt already like a ton of fun. So these were some tricks that I've recently did. Now we are at this amazing skate park. I know it doesn't look like a lot, but it is super fun. This park also provides the right kind of obstacle for the final challenge of this video, the legendary salt flip. They will dust them super good on quarter pipes. And I've been trying to do that, but I haven't figured it out yet. So I was super excited when I saw Dave and do one in the outro of his documentary on a kicker, like a kicker rat. And I've never landed a salt flip before. So the first thing, you know what it is going to be, baby steps. So let's try to get familiar with the trick. As you know, I'm super into finger flips, but salt flip always seem kind of strange to me. I figured out so far is that you have to grab it like this. Like you have to twist your wrist instead of grabbing it like this, like this. At this point right here, you gotta do some sort of tray shove, flip-ish, whatever, like the backside way. It should kind of look like this. That is kind of confusing to me. Let's try to do it in tail position. First step. Saw that, finger flip. so sure though. Well, so far so good. I didn't expect to land it this quick. Now we're gonna move this quick, quicker. Now we're gonna move this kicker and we're gonna try to commit fully. Kind of feels like more shove it than an actual flip. Honestly, 
honestly, like this is scary to commit. Like you kind of gotta lean over it. Once again, trying to step out of my comfort zone. Let's do it. I guess I'm just gonna put my foot in. I believe this is my favorite new trick. That was so much fun, oh my god. And I expected this to be more challenging than a mani combo. And it actually took me like 15 tries. I got to find a proper street spot for that trick. Oh my god, that felt so good. Thank you, Damon Song, for all the inspiration through all these years. Since ever I started, I've been watching your videos and it is and it will always be blowing my mind what you did. Also, thank you guys for watching. This is the end of the video. If you want to support me, you can do this on Patreon. Link in the description of the video. All the money gets reinvested in improving, in providing you guys better quality. Also, if you want to buy my new promo, let us out. This is one link in the description as well. That's my favorite board so far. Like, out of the 10 boards that I got, this is the board of the boards. Right, enough talking. Thank you guys. Have a great day.